Greetings nerdlings, recently I ordered something from Blizzard. I wasn't expecting it to arrive quite as fast as it did. I ordered it at the weekend. Today is Friday. No, it wasn't even the weekend. I ordered it during the week, sorry. Today is Friday of the same week I ordered it. And here we have it. I've already unsealed it. I know what I ordered so it doesn't spoil it for me. And... This is the annoying part of unboxing, is unsealing the shit. So, I just unsealed it. And as you can see, it's still covered up by paper and shit. So that can go over there for now. And yes, I still just throw everything everywhere. In case I need to return it, they supply the return label. Nice. Okay, so I'll put that there. Even though you guys can't see it and you couldn't see me. Right. This is what I ordered. Not sure how well they show up. Okay, so I'll probably keep the box for something pretty big okay there's two things in the box they're both Funko figurines later this year I'll be getting another thing from Blizzard that I will be unboxing as well but that will be more awesome than a couple of Funko figurines or pop figurines or whatever the fuck you want to call them okay so first up we've got Arthas and yes I actually do take these things out of the boxes and I do put them up somewhere like Artis and the other one I won't tell you who it is just yet will go generally in and around my computer somewhere because World of Warcraft so this is the Artis Pop Funko figurine nice pretty nice actually uh, makes me want to get the actual proper Artis figurine I'd love it if they did a Play Arts Kai of World of Warcraft stuff. I'd love to get the artist version of this guy, if you remember him. If you've actually bothered watching, that is. Yay! Get back in the box, you stupid bit of plastic. Right, so there's five of them to get. No, six from Blizzard. So there's Illidan, Artis, Diablo, Tyrael, Kerrigan, Jim Raynor. That can't be right. There's got to be more than six because I've got one that's not listed there. Alright. This one is Sylvanas. So I'm not going to remove the plastic from the box. I'm just going to remove the Funko from the box. Who needs the boxes in any way? Okay, so those can go here. I don't want to make too much noise and my bin's full. So, yeah. Sorry about that wasn't paying attention to the screen so I couldn't see where it was but this is the Sylvanas Funko Pop figurine pretty detailed I like how she has her bow in her hand disappointed that Arthas didn't have the uh, sword in his hands Although that would have made the box way bigger, but it would have also made it way cooler. So I'm liking this, so here we have it. Just want to see, focus. Good. She's one of my favourite characters of all time. In fact, she is my favourite character of all time from World of Warcraft, because I remember the story from 
Warcraft 3. I'm not going to get into that now because that would be something for the Lorecraft series. And I'm going to let a friend of mine... Well, I'm going to get a friend of mine, not let. I'm going to get a friend of mine to do the lore for this beauty right here. And see how that goes. So, as you can see, she has the bow. Let's see, cover up my face, see if it focuses on this instead. Nope, not really detailing on it. But, ah, there we go, finally focused. Right, so it's got the bow, it's got the scroll work on the boots. It's got the scroll work on the chest plate. It's got all the details you'd expect. And some you wouldn't. For example, they actually put in the holes in her cape from when she died. And now she's not dead dead, she's undead now. Hence the blue skin. Unlike this cunt, he was just a soulless cunt. And still one of my favourite characters and still awesome. So, where to put them? I know, they can go up here. Ah! Sorry. Cadgar decided to join in the fun. So, let's see. You're going on either side of Batman. Jaina doesn't... Uh, Sylvanas doesn't want to stand. The slightest knock will knock her over. She's not very balanced. Cadgar can go there. Just to show you guys, because I was talking about it, Okay, you can kind of see Arthas, he's here. Just ignore that duct tape. I'll show you guys a bit more. Right, just to show you what's above here. Right there we have Molag Ball. I can't remember her name from The Hack, The Winter Soldier, Edward Elric, Cadgar. You can't see him, but behind Cadgar, you, actually, you can kind of see him. Behind Cadgar is a Edward Kenway. Batman, Sylvanas. Behind Sylvanas is a big ogre or orc or troll or something like that. A black Superman. There's blue Superman. He's blue tacked to the bottom there. And I don't mean black as in skin pigment black. I mean black costume Superman. With a weird laser gun that I have to use to hold him up. The ugliest Hulk I've ever seen. Edward Kenway. And a Batman clock. Down here. Just to give you something that's worth watching. I've got this. Which is signed by Xemnas from Kingdom Hearts 2. Luigi, which I recently unboxed. Paper Crafts. can't remember his name. It's slipping my mind. Papercraft guy from The Witcher 2. Geralt, that's the one. Uh, oh, there we have BB-8 and somebody I have no clue who the fuck it is. My Deadpool pocket watch, which is fucking awesome. I love this pocket watch. It's fucking amazing. mini tour and unboxing all right so that's long enough that's about all there is to show other than my can of coke which i'm quite thirsty at the end of this vid the dream to be sponsored by coca-cola coke if you're listening sponsor me i'll be the cheapest sponsor you've ever had you just have to supply me with coke. That's all you have to do. Yes, I'd sell out for Coca-Cola. Not money. But I wouldn't change my ideals. I'd still say somebody's a cunt. Because we're all cunts. Now, thank you for watching. And as always, remember, play to game and game to play.